This is going to be a quick video on my Vintage Union Special 39,200AE Overlock Sewing Machine. I'll spin the machine around here. I made up this little custom table to operate the machine. Uh, when I found this in a shed, it was on the original table that wasn't in terrible condition. But it was just too much for me to try to keep everything so I let the table go and just kept the machine here and um, I did uh, take the time to clean it up it didn't look like this when I got it it was covered with dust for probably 40 years and needed good cleaning and oiling and um, I did get lucky I was able to find the correct blades that swings over you pull this down I'll show this in a little more detail. I'm just kind of doing a quick overview here. But you got the badge right here that shows Union Special, the model number. Uh, this drops out of your way for threading the machine, obviously. And then uh, there's a little trick you can do here. You can actually, this is spring loaded on a shaft. And uh, let me just check the camera. Okay, I'm going to bring it in a little closer. There we go. This blade, upper blade, this has two blades. I got really lucky and had to go back on eBay and look at my purchase history. Um, this blade is uh, the correct blade for this machine. Somebody was selling them. I got, got a hold of that. And my memory fails me on whether or not, I think I did order, I think there was a blade in the machine it was really old but it had a part number on it and I was able to cross reference that so I have a new blade in the bottom also and then another thing for when you are threading this you can actually um, push this blade out of the way and rotate this foot over so the foot will swing over here completely out of your way so you can get in here and thread all these loopers and you know, the way you got to run it through all the tensioners on the other side Here's a pretty good view of the right side of the machine. You can see, might be able to see the thread in the picture here and the tensioners that it has to go through and all the little tubes and levers it has to run through to get to the needle and the loopers. Here's the front view of the machine with the front guard drop down. You can see the path of the thread through there. And here's the view of the right side of the machine. Here on the side in the casting they stamped Looks like Union Special in the serial number. Here on the front you can see the Union Special badge. Okay, it might take a second to start stitching. Let's see what happens. Now the trick is to keep moving your fabric back at about the same rate. That way you get this braided together thread here. Actually that worked pretty well right from the get-go. Okay, there it is. Alright, as always, thanks for watching.